It's a really cute container. You're like, I don't know yet what's gonna go in you, but like something cute because I need this in my life. Hey Health Nuts, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, we are doing a haul, not a grocery haul, although I know you guys love those, but we are actually doing a home decor and just summary haul. Uh, Matt and I went to Target recently and we picked out some things that they had there that were very fresh and summery and springy. So I thought I would share with you guys what we got. We are obviously still in the process of decorating our home and we are still such a far way to be until we're completed, but uh, definitely Target has some really nice, trendy, budget-friendly home decor things. And I mean, even if you live in Canada, they actually ship to Canada now, which is awesome. But I mean, if you're in the Toronto area, it's like an hour and a half drive, head over to the border, pick up some really cute things and you can bring it back home and just pretend that we have Target in Canada again. <sighs> Sad face, I know. Who misses Target in Canada? I do like times two. All right, let's hop right in. Actually, before we do, make sure you are subscribed to this channel. You can hit that red subscribe button down below. It's free. I post every Monday and Wednesday and Friday on this channel. So lots more videos for you guys to binge watch. Let's hop right in. All right, so first thing here, I actually have this really cute yellow striped beach bag. This is actually Cashew's puppy bag. You know how there's like a diaper bag? You need, if you saw my 10 things I wish I knew before getting a puppy, you know that puppies have like just as many things as babies and you need them when you're going places. So I thought, you know, Cashew's color is yellow. So I thought this was super cute. It's also just like multifunctional. If I just need this for a beach bag, it's awesome as well. Uh, but it has a bunch of things stuffed in here. Uh, also, I'm gonna link all of the items I'm mentioning down below for you guys to check them out. Uh, Cause yeah, all these should be still available. First thing in here is this really cute, I think this is like a wicker kind of, oh, it says canister. I just thought this was the cutest thing. It has a little like plastic insert in it. So we're actually setting up the basement for the Health Nut Shop headquarters, which is really exciting. So I'm just trying to get some decor stuff for down there. So you'll see some things in this hall for downstairs. So I thought this would be really cute for just like an on the bathroom counter uh, holder. Maybe I can put like, I don't know, some cotton swabs, ear swabs, are they cotton? No, cotton rounds, ear swabs. I don't know what is going in here. You know when you buy something and it's a really cute container and you're like, I don't know yet what's gonna go in you, but like something cute because I need this in my life. So that's what happened here. And I mean, worst case scenario, this could just go on a really cute shelf because I got some decor things for a shelf we don't have yet, uh, but you'll see why they're so darn cute. So I got that. And this came in a set. There was like small, medium, large. I may go back for the other sizes. I don't know yet. Uh, then I got some clothing. Now I always, I mean, Target is like a hit, hit or miss when it comes to clothes. Sometimes you find really cute things. Other times it's just kind of like, mm, it's, it's not that exciting. And I'm really picky now when I buy clothes because I just try not to buy things that I'm just gonna wear once and then not wear again, I guess. It's just wasteful and I'm just trying to avoid that. But these are so cute. I forget what this is called, like this like soft denim material. I don't, I don't know if it's like chambray. I'm not sure, but it's, these are so cute. They look so comfy. Now that we have a puppy, I feel like we're gonna be going to like the beach and just being outdoors more. And these are just, they're, you know, great for the summer because they're shorts and they're comfortable. I love that the fact that they just have like a stretchy waistband. And yeah, these were $19.99. You can't go wrong. And I feel like I don't have that many shorts for the summer. So, and they have back pockets. When you have a puppy, you need, or a dog, you have to wear clothes that have pockets. So. Those are really cute. Speaking of dog, yes, I'm a crazy dog mom. Okay, just we can get that out of the way. Um, <laughs> Chloe's gonna laugh, she hasn't seen this stuff. So she is the face on her, the look on her face. Okay, paws, paw print, gray tee. Okay, this is just like, could be pajama wear. I'm totally gonna wear this out. So I just wanted like a loose, relaxed shirt. I thought that was really cute. And as I was seeing that one, I was not looking for dog shirts, just so you know. They just happened to pop out at me. And then look. I love my dog more than my bed though, but yeah, so cute. And this is just like, this probably is gonna be a pajama shirt. Maybe wear it out as well. I don't know, you just, you can't have too many like, just soft, flowy t-shirts to wear with shorts. That's a cute casual outfit I like. And then speaking of clothes, I also got, I feel like every season I get a new pajama set. Matt, every time I buy new pajamas, he's like, don't you have so many pajamas? And I really don't. 
Cause like, I don't know, I, I will have certain ones and I'll just wear them to death and then I have to like eventually get rid of them because they're falling apart. But these are so cute. Like I love the olive green and floral print. I like the tank top. I don't have one. No way, I do have one that's a tank top, but I have another tank top now. And I just love sets, pajama sets. You know, they're so cozy and comfortable. You'll probably see this in a morning routine. That's what inspires me. I'm like, oh, I need this for a video. <laughs> Yeah, it's probably not a good thing, um, but you know, I love those. And then what else do I have here? Uh, a random wooden ball. This is a very random uh, haul, by the way. Uh, so this is, Matt was like, what is this exactly? I'm like, you know, it's, it, it's a wooden sphere. Like it's for a shelf, I don't know. I, if you know me in real life, you might know I love, like when it comes to design stuff, I always tell people like, I love circles. And I don't know why circles make me really happy. Circles and like honeycomb and like natural shapes. I don't know if circles are natural. No, they are, fairies. Circles are natural. It has something in it. Wood orb. This is not a toy. This is not a toy, Cashew. She's passed out. This is so cute. So when we eventually do have shelves in the living room and dining room and stuff, I think these would be really cute for decor stuff. And I got some other things that I think are, are they in here? No, missing another bag, but we'll find it. Okay, so next I have, we did get some things for Cashew because I'm a sucker and like, like really? I don't wanna, is there a squeaker? Oh my, the pit is a squeaker. I don't wanna do it because Cashew, you don't even know how awesome these toys are yet. So it's kind of like a corduroy in the back and it has a bit of that like, I don't know, scratchy paper noise. And then I'm guessing, Oh, yeah, that's a squeaker. Yeah, she's passed out. So darn cute. And in the food trend, we also got a little mushroom, a little shroomy, and an acorn. I don't know why they have so many tags on them. I'm gonna have to rip all these off, but how cute are these? There's just so many toys. I don't know how people re restrain themselves from buying more dog toys. It's kind of like, Mugs, like you can't have too many mugs. You just can't have too many dog toys. They're so cute. And they really are selling themselves to the pet owner. Like Cashew doesn't know if she's chewing on a, an avocado or a monkey. So, you know. Is that it in here? Oh, I totally forgot. What? I just got a cheap pair of sunglasses because last year we went to Laura Gorge, which is this beautiful spot. Chloe's already laughing. Beautiful gorge uh, in qu quarry uh, area in Guelph in Ontario, it's so beautiful. And I had some, uh, they were also cheap sunglasses, but Chloe's boyfriend, Javon, lost them, including my hat. Actually, the hat just went in the water. But anyways, we had a little little incident. My sunglasses got lost in the sea. And there's a, it feels like there's a hair in my face. Oh my God, it's still there. What the? <laughs> I feel like every summer you need your, just like your cheap plastic throw on, throw off, pair of sunglasses or sunnies if you're from Australia. And yeah, I really, I really like these. There was two pairs I was contemplating on. Matt said this one was cute. So I went with his opinion. I think that's everything in here. Okay, I have to find, there's another wicker basket. Maybe we left it in the car, we'll check, uh, but we'll go in, we'll go through the other things while we're looking for that. Speaking of downstairs in our Health Nut Shop headquarters makeover, we got a bathroom mirror. So if, like downstairs has like the bathroom. Can you see yourself? I glory. No. <laughs> there. No. Yeah. Oh. Hi. Hi, Chloe. What's up? <laughs> uh, so we got this beautiful wooden circle mirror. Once again, see, I like round things. It's just, I don't know. They're very aesthetically pleasing to me. So we got this mirror because downstairs in the bathroom, we repainted it. It was this like really dark olive green. It was a little dark for a basement bathroom. We painted it a light, fresh color. Uh, but the mirror right now that's there is just one of those like standard square ones, the thin ones. And I thought, why don't we get rid of that one and then place this one. We'll just putty the holes and we'll put this one and make it look way more health nutty. I love natural textures and materials into a space. It just brings like the outdoors in and it's very calming. And Chloe, what do you think of our new bathroom mirror, office bathroom mirror? So I think that's really, really cute. Uh, for upstairs, we got this really heavy light, which I'll put in B-roll shots of it set up because Matt said he's gonna set that up this weekend. So we'll put a shot of it done. It looks so beautiful. I saw it displayed at Target and Oh my God. This is it here. 
it's beautiful. It was a pretty good price considering it looks like something you would buy at West Elm. I feel like Target gets a lot of inspo from West Elm, but it's way cheaper. So this was 129, which may seem expensive, but at West Elm, you're looking at like, even for, there was a ceiling light I liked on sale, it was like 450. So lighting can be really expensive and this is beautiful. It has like a gold brush finish. The base of it is a faux marble and I just love the look of it. And you know, we're having to spend a lot of money in our place. So if I can save some money in some areas, I'm gonna do that. We'll set this up. Hopefully it looks good in the space. We're gonna put it, I think like right behind me here or maybe in that corner if we do a chair. I don't know, we might move things around, but I really like this and I'm excited to, uh, to set it up. So Matt has a weekend project. <laughs> So now that the summer weather is around the corner, I thought it'd be really good to buy a cooler. I've never purchased a cooler before. I feel like an official adult because I've always just borrowed one from my parents or a friend, but I am officially an adult. We have our own cooler. How health nutty is this? It's a turquoise or like aqua green. I don't know, it's, it's definitely beautiful. And this one is just like a little one and I like it. It's perfect for, I don't know why it has like things to close it, like maybe twist ties, maybe to prevent bears. I don't know, but like no one's, who's gonna steal our, our sandwiches from the beach. Uh, so this is a great size. If you're just doing a day trip, maybe you're just like going to the park or going to the beach for a little bit with your puppy and, or just like having a little romantic date, that would be a good one. And then we thought, okay, well, we, like what if we're doing an all day trip? Then you need, or a weekend, then you need the mama size. This is the daddy size, I don't know. Maybe that one was the mom. Uh, so this is just a massive one. Like, look how much it's gonna fit. Cashew could fit in there. <laughs> She'll be nice and cool if she gets hot. Uh, and I think there's like a, yeah, there's a little handle and rolly and we are ready for the beach. So I really love this matching set. They had other colors, there was a blue one. I don't know if there was, oh, there was red. I don't know if there was yellow. If there was yellow, I probably would have gotten that one uh, as well. But these are really cute and I think they're gonna be really functional for the summer. I'm gonna go find that the other missing items because I know they're somewhere BRB. So we found the missing item. So this matches the other little wicker canister that's gonna go in the bathroom downstairs. And then this is gonna go on the toilet. So the back of the toilet, I think this will be a really cute storage area and the perfect size. And then inside, Cashew's like wondering what this is. We got some more decorative stuff for a shelf. So they had the cutest little, this is actually a candle, but it, guess what it looks like? An acorn, which is obviously the Health Nut logo. And it's just so cute. So I don't think I'm actually gonna burn it. It's more just like for decor. And, oh, it smells nice, huh? Ooh, it smells really good. It is a soy candle, so I think I can burn it without it bothering me. Yeah, I kinda wanna get more colors. It's so cute. It's a nice soft matte texture. And then get a load of this. This is so cute. Oh, it's really heavy too. The cashier was like, what is this? I was like, it's an artichoke. She's like, I know, but what is it? I'm like, it's, it's a decor item, I don't know. So this, I love the colors, very neutral and soft. I love the texture. Obviously, I love that it's food. I think this is gonna be really cute in our future shelf for the dining room. So like this, maybe this, maybe the wooden orb. I think those will all like be really cute together. Right, Cashew? Should we give Cashew her, her toy? <gasps> look, <gasps> look, that's for you. That's for you. That's for you. This the avocado. Do you like it? Oh, oh, do you like it? She's like, I'm trying to get it. And off it goes. Oh, and last but not least, we also got a beautiful welcome mat that's outside right now. It's pretty large and it's kind of makes a mess. Like you don't want to bring it in the house. It has, I don't know what the material is. It's like burlap or something, but it sheds like crazy. So keeping it outside, but we'll do a little shot of what it looks like. It's really beautiful. And I'm just excited to finally have some new pieces. We can slowly decorate our home like we, or it's really me that's decorating the home, let's be honest. Uh, my mom has a shelf that she's been trying to give to us and we just have to repaint it. And she, last night we went there for dinner and she's like, oh Matt, come see the shelf, see if you want it. 
And he goes, let's be honest, I have no say in the decorations for the place, which isn't true, he does, but when it comes to like colors and a design, I, not that I'm a prof professional, but he really just trusts and relies on me to do it, which is totally fine, because I don't mind doing it. So. That is everything I picked up from Target. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I would love to know if you guys have any ideas of things I should pick up from there for the new house. Leave me a comment down below. As I mentioned, I'm gonna have all of the links to the products I mentioned in this video in the info box down below so you guys can check that out. And if you guys want to subscribe, make sure you click that red subscribe button down below. I post every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And I hope to see you guys back here for another video. Oh, you're not supposed to be on the couch. Guys, should Cashew be on the couch or not? I don't know. We're trying to be those like parents that dogs can't be on the bed and couch, but like maybe the couch is okay. I don't know. She's just like, I know Chloe's like, mm. She's like, loves the couch. And I'm sick of sitting on the floor. <laughs> hey, we just won't tell daddy. How about during the day, you can be on the couch with mommy? Yes. And then at night, no. Hey. She's like the sweetest thing. Okay. I'm sorry for all the cashew, but no. <laughs> all right, guys. Uh, have a fabulous day. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.